as Grant Park at uefacescotland.com and uh, most contacts made through the internet at our website www.uefacescotland.com We're located approximately four miles outside of Inverness in the Highlands of Scotland. We bring in people from all over the world. We've covered about every continent in the world as per numbers of fly fishers. Um, they contact us through our website, they come to Scotland. Uh, it could be their one time, it could be their lifetime trip. It could be something they've saved up for all their life, coming to Scotland to fly fish for the brown trout or the Atlantic salmon. So we look after all their needs when they're here, whether it be for fly fishing or just the, the hospitality and fly fishing. So mainly hospitality and fly fishing. Our guiding outfit covers all our range from uh, salmon, Atlantic salmon fishing, on the fly, on a double handed rod. We do that on the River Spey, the River Tay, the Tweed, the Devron. There's that many rivers in Scotland, world famous rivers, that we have uh, access to some private beats on those. We've also got access to some private beats further north. Again, that will allow us to fly fish for Atlantic salmon, brown trout, sea trout, and some other lesser known species such as Arctic char. The lock that we're fishing at right now is a private lock owned and run by us at UFA Scotland. Um, the uniqueness about this lock is we just don't have brown trout in this lock. We have uh, blue trout, rainbow trout, brown trout, arctic char and pike. Pike being the most aggressive out of the whole lot. The pike are famed in the highlands of Scotland for being one of the most aggressive fish in Scotland. And the highland pike more so than the southern pike. When you're bringing the fly rod, keep that rod pointing to the water. A lot of the people we get coming here have never really fly fished before. Or they have, they fished tiny little streams, um, probably about three foot wide, five foot wide. We're fishing big waters, we're fishing big rivers, we're fishing fast moving waters. So when they come here, it's a whole new experience. So we start the day off with some tuition. I spend one to one with everybody that comes just to get them into a scenario where I can actually get them onto a fish. We've never failed yet. Everybody that's come to Scotland, we've got a fish. We're 100% accurate on that. It's hard, but it depends on the individual as well. If the individual is willing to work with us and listen to us, we'll get that fish. Scotland today is so accessible uh, from America and Canada. It's so easy. I have a direct flight into Glasgow, a three hour train ride up north and you're here. That's it. We pick you up at the air, either at the airport or at the railway station and we bring you straight here or we'll take you to a river or we'll take you elsewhere. It's approximately, I would say, flying time, four or five hours. You can fly into either Glasgow, Edinburgh, even into Dublin and fly directly to Inverness. You can uh, fly to Amsterdam. An hour later, you're in Inverness. Inverness is probably more easy to get to than some parts of your own homeland, whether it be Montreal or BC or even America. You know, it can be a long, arduous journey with a long, arduous drive here. What you guys would class as a four or five hour drive to us is quite a big drive. So you can be here within three hours. <laughs>